tectonics and continental drift is widely accepted within the scientific community, but what evidence do we have to support it? We know the boundaries of present-day tectonic plates from looking at maps of seismic and volcanic activity, as well as using complex satellite data to track their movement. Modern continents seem to fit together like pieces of a puzzle. 250 million years ago, today's continents formed one supercontinent, Pangaea. Other evidence includes fossils. Fossils of related plants and animals have been found on neighboring continents, suggesting that they were once joined. Furthermore, ancient rock units, cratons, and even mountain belts have been found to span across continents, creating continuous linear features. And finally, paleomagnetic data has revealed magnetic strips on the seafloor at mid-ocean ridges. This is because in molten rock, magnetic minerals line up in relation to Earth's magnetic pull at the time. And that was evidence for plate tectonics in a minute.